um, Morello. I'd have to know more about her family and like what illness does her mom have, do her father and her brother work, uh, to sort of get to the to the core of like what's going on with her. It, it's she's a really interesting character, um, and I just so, sort of have some scattered thoughts because it, she's it's really tough to say like what would her life be like under socialism or like should she be in because obviously she's a dangerous person based on what she did, but you got to try to understand why she did it which means getting to, to the core of her as a person. So, um, I theorize that a strong component of erotomania is an unmet need for love. I doubt this is anything groundbreaking. It's, it seems pretty logical, right? So, in Morello's case, it's mixed with difficult family circumstances that she wants to escape. So she creates her own reality, right? She creates the reality that this guy loves her, and she creates this sort of you know, reality where she's lost probably in the world of like celebrity and, and all that kind of stuff and, and West Side Story. And uh, one thing I guess that I, I wanted to talk about related to that is socialist versus capitalist culture, which I've talked about a number of times already, and this is another example of it where I think in a socialist culture there would be more love available. Like capitalism, what it tries to sell to people and promote is for you to buy their shit. Like, it tries to give women a negative image of themselves so that they'll go out and they'll buy these products because it puts money in the pockets of the capitalists. That's what it's all about. Under socialism, with things I mentioned before, it would improve human relations. So even if she's got these problems within her family that she wants to escape, she's more likely to meet people that would love her and that would give her what she needs, what's that, you know, that unmet need for love. And the one question that I, I sort of put here, which is, whatever, I just want to say it. Will Nikki give her the amount of time and love necessary to keep her in reality? That's the question that I think we'll see answered or whatever in one way or another in season three. It's like, Nikki, if she really gives her the attention that she needs to, to Morello, I think that can actually help keep her in reality. But is Nikki going to be willing to do that is a question. It's a lot of work. It's a lot of work, so who knows, but I hope she does, you know, if they were real people, I, I would hope that that, that would happen, because, you know, I, I like Morello, you know, but it's a sad, sad story. <laughs>